Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, I'm Georgian. If you are not new, welcome back. In today's video, I have a quick one. It's kind of a quick one for this segment. Um, I'm gonna be doing a quick get ready with me. I'm going to brunch, yes, and I'm going to take you guys with me. So this portion, I'm just gonna get glammed up pretty quickly. Yeah, I decided to do this little piece for you guys and I will be vlogging the rest of the video. So are you excited for that? I feel like I'm excited because me excited. If you like to see me beat my face and get ready for my brunch, then please keep on watching. You can see my brows are already done and I just have to get into the whole prepping, priming. So I'm gonna pull my mirror over here. Excuse me, you're gonna be seeing my mirror. <laughs> I'm gonna start moisturizing my face. All right, so I'm just gonna go in. And I'll be using just a little bit of primer, not too much, my milk primer. Going in with my Estee Lauder foundation, bronze. And of course guys, if you do need a detailed tutorial on how I do my foundation routine, that will be linked. I will have it slide across in the eye cards and it will be linked in my description box below. Now I'm gonna use my two Juvia's Place concealers in number 13 being the lighter one and number 13 being the darker one, number 16 being the lighter one. So I'm gonna use number 13 first. So now I'm going to use my Maybelline Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder in number 15 light. I'm gonna use a little bit of the Sasha Buttercup as well. Not too much. Cause the yellow vibe, the yellow, the yellow something there, I don't really want that. But I still need a little bit more color because the other powder had made me look a little bit too washed out. So I just used the Sasha Buttercup to bring back a little color. I don't really have sinuses or sinus issues or whatever it is, but it makes my nose start to like run and do these weird things and then like all the time because it's just so much powders and it's just powdery. <laughs> Better the least, cause we wanna look good though. Just a little sniffles and then it goes away. But not bad. All right, that look a little better now. And then we're going to set everything with my Maybelline Fit Me in the number 330. having some ginger and mint tea guys normally when we make it we use the ginger bag and this and the mint bag at the same time so we have a mixture of ginger and mint really love it like i can't drink any of them on on their own anymore like the two of them together buzzy Me, like, 
Kasi hello cute. Me. The girl here. Oh, fix up. Contour. Dark deep. MAC mineralized skin finish. Brunch is a thing in Cayman on Sundays. Big things. Big, big things. And you know, with brunch and those little, you know, daytime looks in general, I really feel like it should be pretty light, fresh, nothing too colorful, too extra. That is me. Okay, I'm going to use some blush. My Jordana blush, guys. The 12 Redwood. The same powder that I had used to set my face. Yeah, I'm going back in with that to contour my nose. Nothing too crazy, guys. Now I'm just going to do a simple neutral look on the eyes. Going in with my Morphe and Jaclyn Hill collaboration palette. You know this one already. This one is the Ring the Alarm, right? Ring the Alarm. One of my go-tos because these colors are perfect for any occasion. Nighttime, daytime. This palette is it. Mugshot, this one here. And just give my eyelids a little bit of color. Mostly just at the outer corner. What time? 11.40, I know. Good time. And I don't have no hair to comb, so I like that. Just to do my edges and put on my clothes, lotion up my skin. I'm already. All right, so that same, my eyes still, my eyes still, <laughs> my eyes still look a little bit, you know, kind of empty. So to give it more life, that same shade that I put on my lid, I'm going to just use a flat, a flatter brush, kinda like this. And just place that same color, just at my lower lash line there. Gonna put my eyeliner on, just at my lower lash line there. And I'm going to be using this NYX Professional Makeup um, Eyeliner. I really, really like it. It's literally like butter. Literally like. I love it so much. Everything that I'm using though, I will link it in the description box below, of course. This is how it looks. about done I'm gonna use my Maybelline Big Shot mascara love this love this love this oh I'm gonna forget my lower lash line let me spray my face before I do my lower lash line my Morphe setting mist you know to seal the deal love it favorite oh, yes big jump I went to put on my outfit lotion and my skin and stuff I realized I didn't use any highlights so I'm just gonna add some highlights that's my master chrome 100 molten gold and a tops in the tear duct area I think I want to wear a necklace. No, I'm fine. <laughs> I'm gonna show you how I refresh it really quickly. I use this. I absolutely love braids. I love braids a lot. So I cannot go without this. This is my sulfur 8 medicated dandruff treatment for braids. This, let me keep my braids long. I tend to have dry scalp and those little things. 
that nobody wants <laughs> especially when you're having your braids and stuff and then it starts to flake or whatever this keep everything under control of course additional oils and stuff to your roots help as well but as far as it goes with the itching and all of that mm -mm. so this i spray it in my hair every morning before work and it keeps my roots looking very like nourished and moisturized as well even though it's not an oil but I really like it and the next thing I do is add my gel to my edges to dress it up a bit so my eco style this is the one with black castor oil and flaxseed oil so in terms of how I get ready you guys can kind of tell face first then my clothes then my hair And anytime I'm going out to eat or anything like that, I tend to like not even bother with the lipstick or anything because I can't bother with all of that. So I always just wear my favorite lip gloss of all time. When I buy this, I buy like two, three, four at a time because I really like it and it's very affordable. It's super moisturizing, like I really, really love this lip gloss. So it's my LA Colors High Shine Shea Butter Lip Gloss. I have been using this for ages. I will link it below as well if you are interested in getting one. I buy it off Amazon. At this point, you can call me the Amazon girl. <laughs> I think I'm ready. Um, let's see if I can show you guys. So this is my hair. Okay, so that's it for the get ready with me portion. And now we're gonna move on to the vlog portion which I know you guys are excited about, I am excited too. So I will see you in that clip, all right? Okay, so Jay is coming now. Okay, <laughs> hey guys, so Dre is here now. You're not telling the people good afternoon, good What's afternoon. What's going on, guys? What's going on? Good day, good morning, good afternoon. Good night. <laughs> oh, watching this at night. Yes, so like I said before, see, but oh, me. Yes. Okay, so we're on our way to brunch now and the spot that we're going to is called Spanglish. It's located in the Strand. Um, for those of you who live here in Cayman, of course. Um, this is our second time going. We've been there already and we really liked it. The vibe was good there and everything, so we say we'd go back there again. We went there for our friend's birthday the first time and now we're just going back. Just the two of us.
<laughs> All right, guys, so we just pulled up. We are here now, and me hungry. So, I'm gonna eat some food. So, I'll see you guys inside. Okay guys, so we are done with brunch. It was good. Thank you Spanglish for having us. For having us. Them invite me? No, they never no, invite, they invite me. me. But their service was good. Yes, their service was good. The first time and the second time around. Enjoyed it. Um, I have my shades on now. Before I didn't put them on because you know, I already to go crease up the makeup. But we going home now so I can look cool in my shades <laughs> <laughs> yeah. cool kid brunch is always a good little relax relaxing and chill type of activity to do on a Sunday and I enjoyed myself the food was good the vibe was good like I said before I couldn't really vlog as much or talk as much in there because 
there's like a DJ every Sunday and he might go hard with the music then. Me like that. So I never had a problem with that. I like that. If you're into that type of like energy with music and you know, constantly going, yeah, that would be a good place for you to have brunch. But we're heading home now. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and remember to check my description box for everything that I use to, you know, my makeup, my makeup products that I use to get my face done. All my filming equipment, the camera that I'm vlogging on now, all of that will be linked in my description box below. And I really hope you guys enjoy this mixture of, you know, vibe in this video today. And until next time, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Say so bye. See you get up. Bye. <laughs> bye guys. I have guess. Excuse me, Jesus. That was a little awful. I'm not sure if I'm going to edit that out. <laughs>